In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to do the horizontal rope row. Now this is an amazing movement for developing serious grip strength and also pulling strength. It's something that we use as an intermediate movement in the UMS online coaching program, but it is something that is going to take your upper body strength to the next level. We are the gym that teaches people how to move instead of just exercise because we believe that health is about performance, not just body image. Now we're on to the single arm rope row. So this is a progression for our horizontal pull pattern in the UMS online coaching program. And this is a, an intermediate progression. We want to, you want to think of that before you attempt something like this, there's certain prerequisites that you have to meet and you really need good scapular control. So you need to be able to do a row pattern where you can engage the scapular retractors row, keep retracted and come down, okay? You, that's, those are the things that we develop in the UMS online coaching program before you move on to this stuff. So don't be going straight to this kind of a movement um, just because it's something that you haven't done before. If you haven't checked those boxes of the things that you need to be able to uh, control before you move on to a movement like this. Um, because if you do, you're just gonna develop poor movement patterns. You're not gonna, under, the body's not gonna understand what it's meant to be achieving. And you know, the, the only real reason why you would do this over a, a ring row or a, um, uh, a bent over row is for the grip. Uh, you know, when you, when you grab onto a rope, the only thing that you're really changing is the way that your grip works. Uh, and the only reason you would do that is if you've exhausted um, the developmental possibilities of what you do from normal rowing. So if you're still in the area where you're trying to make your shoulders move properly, there's very little reason to be messing around with the grip and trying to make it more challenging on the arms. So just make sure that you understand why you would do this before you do it, okay? So what I'm gonna do, and I'm, I'll demonstrate the movement and then I'll explain how you progress and regress it, okay? So from here, I'm just gonna come down into my start position, row like this, back down, release the scapula. So I engage by pulling the shoulder back into retraction. So that's the first part of the movement. Then I'm gonna row until my arm comes to all the way to my shoulder. And then I'm gonna go back down and then release the scapula. So one, two, three, four. Except by this stage of the program, you shouldn't need to break it down that much. And you should be able to just do it all in one go. Now, the way that you would do this, I've set this up purely so that we can make the video. This is an easier spot to film. Normally the rope hangs down here, so you can see it just comes, you know, all the way down to the ground. So if I had the rope hanging down here, then I've got all these possibilities for where it is that I want to be able to uh, anchor myself from. Now for the most basic version, what you want to do is you want to set yourself up so that you're standing with your hand touching the shoulder like this, but you can lean back so that there's still a little bit of weight in your arm. You never want to be at a point when you're doing the exercise where there's no weight in the arm, which there is here, I'm just standing on my feet. So if I can go here, well there's a bit of weight in my arm, then when I go back, whoops, the rope's sliding a bit, so if I start from here, and then when I come back, this is a position, the angle of my body is at such a uh, point that it's mechanically more advantageous for me and I can, uh, because this is a calisthenics movement, so the, the leverage is what determines how hard it is and that's mechanically quite advantageous to be back at an angle here, it's not very hard. Whereas if I go like this, if I bring my feet forward now so that in the top position I'm already leaning back and then when I go down I'm way more horizontal, that is way harder, okay? So what you have to do is find the point of leverage that works for you to be able to do perfect technique for the right amount of reps. So in the UMS online coaching, of course, it depends if you're doing an accumulation phase or an intensification phase. If it's an accumulation phase, you know, we're looking for that uh, seven to nine rep range, about eight reps for somebody that is, uh, has more than one year training age, or a 10 to 12 rep range for somebody with less than one year training age. If it's an intensification phase, you're looking at more like the five, uh, the three to five rep range. Now, if you consider that this is, is probably quite a hard movement for a lot of you, if you've never done it before, 
for a lot of you, it is going to be an intensification movement. It might be too much for you to be able to use in an accumulation phase. You have to be really, really clear on why you do certain movements. And that's what we do in the UMS Online Coaching Program. We're very clear on this is why we're doing this movement. We don't just throw things at you for the sake of it, okay? And this, this is used to really develop some amazing grip strength and strengthen your whole pulling movement pattern. It's a beautiful movement, it's very, very good, and it's the entry to uh, rope climbing and rope training in the UMS program. Hey, thanks for watching that video. If you liked it, consider subscribing to our channel and make sure you click the notification bell so you know when our weekly videos are uploaded. Now, the best thing for you to do if you wanna stay connected with us and get free online coaching is to join our private Facebook group. It's called the UMS Movement Mastermind and we go live daily where we answer our members' questions. It's very interactive because you can post questions while we're live and we interact with you on the show you can also upload videos or pictures of yourself with any movements, any stretches, strength training movements, calisthenics, weightlifting, anything that you're struggling with, and we'll critique you, give you feedback, let you know how you can get better. It's a really valuable resource. It allows a lot of communication with us and also our senior tribe members. You'll get answers very, very quickly, and it's absolutely free. So jump on Facebook, search for UMS Movement Mastermind, and join now. Until next time, have a great day.